Well, a sort of unboxing video, but really the motivation for this is in response to uh, some comments about the availability of Playmobil Locos in the UK. Well, in the UK, they've got a certain price that they seem to be fetching, uh, but you can find them on the continent in the Netherlands and Germany. And typically the Loco with remote control without tracking anything is 75 euros. But you'll be paying about 19 euros postage and then they add VAT onto that, which is nearly another 19 euros. So you're paying 112 euros or so. Uh, really, you're paying 95 pounds delivered. I ordered this uh, three, four days ago. It was due the day, uh, all right. It arrived three days early. That's all I can say. Uh, so, okay. It, w it was a five day, five, six day delivery, but it came in three. So that's not bad. I'm not going to complain about that. So it cost 95 pounds. Uh, let me say this isn't the first thing that I've bought from Germany. So I shopped with a, a measure of confidence. Uh, I've got a German newspaper wrapping it and a bit of other wrapping. Uh, just normal wrapping, but it's in a reasonable box. So the box is what's kept it safe, basically, and then the wrapping. That's the remote control. As I look at it, it looks to be in pretty decent condition. That's looking all right. Uh, and this is the loco itself. So let me lift it out and park it somewhere. Uh, we need to give it a, a, a test, don't we? But, again, that looks to be in pretty decent condition. I'm not noticing any uh, problems with that. What do the wheels look like? Take it towards the window. Uh, not bad at all. No great evident signs of wear. 1782, whatever age that is, it doesn't really matter. Uh, and so there we have it. That's a Playmobil Loco, which I will be doing something to. Uh, and available in April 2022. There seemed to be plenty about this uh, person selling these had of the order of 10 available at this price, uh, which is 75 euros, uh, which translates to 95 of your English pounds by the time you paid the postage and the VAT on top of that delivered to your door, say five days, which is what they estimate. Uh, mine came a little bit early. It's not even missing any of the side bits. It's had these, which which if you buy it brand new, you have to apply it yourself. The sticky representation of checker plate on there. Uh, and therefore I'm quite pleased with that because they are a good local. So this is a remote control, battery remote control with light and sounds and will be transformed. I've got two in this original condition. I'll look at them and uh, one of those two is going to be transformed a fair bit. I'll keep one original uh, and there's no harm having another one of these. How many G-scale locos of this sort of quality and this sort of adaptability in terms of what you can do with it. Uh, it's a very robust locomotive uh, can you buy for £95? Not many these days. Uh, and I've just done this now for those of you who might be a little bit nervous about buying from Germany. Caveat emptor, as they say. You never know. But uh, I can certainly say that if you use eBay, the chances are you'll be dealing with somebody fairly decent. Uh, and they will 
respond properly to you and there'll be no problems. That's my experience. Your experience may be different, but certainly I'm a satisfied customer. Uh, and I think that's good value for money. Bearing in mind, of course, that the first couple I bought were £80 new in box from a UK supplier. That's where you paid for the Playmobil train sets. So second hand, they appreciate in value. Uh, £150 is not unusual now for an £80 thing uh, second hand. Can you believe that? Well, it's G scale. Of course you can. 